All right, y'all. So this happened out of the around the Columbia, South Carolina area. I've lived out there for a short period of time myself, back about 20 years ago, military related. But Rick Chow, okay, and a gas station is supposed to be in Richland County, has uh, chased down, it was Cyrus Carmack Belton. Now, this boy is 13 years old, okay? He is being arrested for shooting this boy in the back, okay? When he ran out of the store because it was expected he had stole, I don't know, a couple of bottles of water or some crap, all right? Now, I like to say that, uh, say this, it was wrong. Even the police chief out in that area, okay, or the county sheriff, he came and said that it was wrong, even if he did do it. Yes, that, that is wrong, okay? Uh, but the re reports say something about he suspected it. This is just as a store owner child. And I guess he talked to him about it. There was a verbal altercation ensued. And, and like I say, the boy ran out of the store. And child and his son chased him. And shot the boy. And shot the boy. Now, reports are saying that his son had the gun. And this, uh, and the boy was also was suspected to have a gun, and it was confirmed by the local authorities out there that he did have a gun on him, but he didn't use the gun. Now, a couple of things that I think that uh, puzzled me about this story: why is the son not being charged? The father is, but the son is not. And why does why did that boy have a gun on him? Okay. Now it was wrong, but I'm just puzzled of the move, the movements that there, are of this case. Now, the news is try was trying to reach out to the pro uh, I guess the prosecutors and also the sheriff out there about what charges will be made or whatever or what specific charges, and they wouldn't bring out uh, up the charges other than manslaughter, okay? Like, they didn't get too much into the charges, okay? So I'm really, really interested or intrigued of, the, again, of the, I don't know, the mannerisms of this case. And again, it was wrong. You have protesters out there protesting uh, about it, and they want to see uh, the child uh, and his son as well both being put on charges. Now, the gas station is all boarded up, closed and everything. Okay. So, it's an open and shut case. I'm going to put it like that. Okay. Uh, while I got you here, let's push that aside. And I just want to probably put some pointers out there. Okay. I'm not saying that the boy did anything. Okay. The young, the, the little, uh, the 13 year old boy. All I'm saying is don't do anything to, con to constitute, okay, or, or for a store store owner or law enforcement, the con, uh, how can I say, to suspect that you're stealing or maybe the constitute that you may be stealing. You understand what I'm saying? Okay, anytime that you're in the store and you have to look over your shoulder and somebody sees you, okay, then that means that you making yourself, you putting yourself at risk to be a suspect, all right? If you have to steal something, that means you don't need it, okay? Again, that was not enough proof, but like I said, they confirmed it, that even stealing a bottle of water is, does not constitute you, you being killed over what to the theft. I think that people that, protect those their stores and so forth their property yeah still in his wrong okay but i just think that people that try to defend their property once again that they need to probably use discernment and probably more restraint all right when it comes to defending your property and all that okay unless someone is trying to kill you yeah you know you do have a right to protect your your property but in the case like that 
not acceptable. But all I'm saying is also for people, not just young people, but people to try to do what you can for as far as the preventative measures. You, you understand what I'm saying? So let's see how this case is going to work out. Okay. Uh, hopefully justice will be served. Let me know what you think of the video about the video and thank you for your time. All right, stay tuned for the next video. Like, subscribe, share, cash app, dollar sign, Winston Spivey if you want to donate.